Welcome to Avtech's video introduction to Device Manager. For customers who want a local software install or require network actions, such as automated system shutdowns and reboots, Avtech's Device Manager software is provided at no extra cost and can be downloaded through your GoToMyDevices account while your subscription for extended service and support is active. Device Manager is an all-in-one solution for discovering, managing, and monitoring your room alert devices. Use the software to configure alerts on sensors to notify you immediately when there is an issue that needs to be addressed, or configure Device Manager to perform automatic corrective action. All sensor and alert data is stored in an embedded SQL database for historic reporting, logging, and graphing. Device Manager runs as a Windows service. By default, you can access it by entering localhost colon 8080 or the IP address of the host system colon 8080 into your web browser address bar. Your discovered devices appear in a list to the left of the screen. Device Manager automatically discovers your room alert devices network-wide using a UDP broadcast or push technology. If your room alert does not automatically appear in the list, you can use the advanced discovery options. In the list, you can view the icons next to your device's names to quickly see which devices have alerts in progress and if any devices are offline. You can also set up a ping on other network devices by selecting the Monitor Network Devices button. In your dashboard, you can configure widgets to display general statistics, 24-hour sensor graphs, or tables of data. This quick view of the top five sensors with the most alerts, for example, can help you to track trends in your environment. If you select one of your discovered room alert devices, its data will appear. Hold the control key while selecting multiple units from the list to view them all on one screen. In the header, you can view basic information about your device, access the room alert web interface, update the unit's firmware, and more. In the Sensor Display tab, you can easily check the value and alarm state of each of the unit's sensors. In the Graph Display tab, Device Manager will, by default, show the last 24 hours of sensor data. You can view graph data from any recorded time period by selecting the Start and End calendars. To add or remove sensors from the graph, simply select the sensor label in the graph legend. In the Configured Alerts tab, you can view all of the alerts you currently have configured for your device. Note that current alert statuses are also displayed at the bottom of the screen. If there are alerts in progress, this status bar will be outlined in red. Otherwise, it will be green. This Alert History tab lists alerts that were previously triggered and have cleared for the selected device. If you select Edit, you can add a note about what caused the alert, who is responding to the alert, or how they responded to the alert. To view a complete alert history, select this status bar to expand the window. Configure your alerts and schedule tasks in the Alerts Tasks page. First, create any contacts you wish to notify. Note that Device Manager can send messages to cell phones by using their email to SMS address. Along with sending email notifications, you can configure Device Manager to complete other actions here, such as toggling relays and signal tower LEDs, sending web URL requests, sending screenshot images from Access Network cameras, and more. Next, create an action notification list. This list tells Device Manager what actions to take in response to alert conditions. Lastly, create your alert or task. You also have the option of creating a schedule to attach to an alert, task, or action, causing it to only run inside the chosen time frame. In the Settings page, you can configure device settings, such as your discovery scan interval. Export or reset sensor and alert notification data from one or more devices from any chosen time period. 
configure your SMTP email server and send yourself a test email. Configure your external modem to be used with Avtech's dial-out plugin bundle. Configure web server settings. Set up user accounts with various levels of privileges. Configure an external database. And block any IP addresses from discovery. In the help page, you can download logs you may need for troubleshooting. This page also has a link to our collection of frequently asked questions. Avtech has a large collection of frequently asked questions to help you configure your device manager installation and utilize device managers plugins, which are available for download if your organization has a go to my devices service plan at the professional level. Device Manager is ideal for advanced monitoring, the ability to reuse action notification lists and other items to create an unlimited amount of alerts and tasks makes for a straightforward process as you customize Device Manager to best fit your needs. This makes it easy for users with multiple room alert units to monitor and document environment conditions, improve reliability, and decrease unplanned downtime or costly hardware replacement. You also have the option to monitor your room alert devices through Avtech's cloud monitoring service, gotomydevices.com. With Go to My Devices, users can stay informed with account messages, keep an inventory of devices and map them for visual account, and have quick access to all subscription information in one place, making it easy to stay organized. Go to My Devices alerting and reporting features provide users with insight needed to facilitate better decision making planning, and response action, which results in greater uptime for organizations and lower mean time between hardware failures. All of these Go to My Devices features are simple to use, and the experience is consistent whether on a desktop, laptop, tablet, or mobile device, making it the most convenient method for monitoring your room alert devices. If you have any additional questions, please feel free to contact us by email at sales at avtech.com or support at avtech.com or by live chat at our website, avtech.com. Thank you.